this is really interesting. He's been talking to that guy for at least half an hour. And his colleagues are just standing there waiting, and now someone is getting out of the car. Are they talking to him? Hmm. Today's episode. How do you do into bubbles and bubble milk? I do that out of. You know, out of frame, I'm waving to you. What was it? Supposed to say? How do you do into Webbers and Webber? Welcome to Stories of My Life. Today, <coughs> still got <coughs> that stupid cough. I'm feeling fine. It's just stupid cough and some sort of congestion in the nose. Um, anyway, it's Friday, Stockholm, Sweden. The sun is out. It's really cold. There's snow everywhere. I left my bike in San Francisco. No, I left my heart at the theatre. So uh, today I'm taking the subway in and I also will do some uh, grocery shopping because I have not prepared food for this weekend. Voluntarily, no. Yeah, voluntarily. I, you know, it's not that I sort of... I just decided not to. I decided to sort of buy things and cook there or prepare there. So join me for a fun peek at the backside of Frog Bixit. Today we're having, wait, yesterday two people were out, today one person is out. Um, and it just keeps rolling. Some of you might notice that I'm wearing this. If you saw the video yesterday and I guess you, of the stories yesterday, I bet you noticed that Johanna had a fur coat just like this. Well, it's a fake fur. I bought it first a year ago, over a year ago, and then she saw it a couple of, well, maybe a month ago when I was wearing it, and she said, I want that, I want that. And I found it online, and I said, I'll buy it for you, and you can reimburse me. So I did. So today, she asked me, wear that tomorrow so we can twin. I don't know what we're supposed to do, but maybe take a picture. I'm not sure. Anyway, yeah. So I just missed the train. Damn. Oh, nine minutes. This seems to be happening at the theatre. Not quite sure what. Thank you, Christina, for noticing. <laughs> David just sat here, he didn't, <laughs> he didn't see anything. But, um, seems to be no worries. Anyway, here I am with David, who's a makeup artist and a fantastic wig maker. You love wiggetry, don't you? Wiggetry is the best I know. Yes. Today you're doing a part in the show. Yes. Are you a trained dancer and actor? Yes. I need to dance a lot for this role. Yep. Yes. So I dance my way across the stage. Yes. To Tuba, yes. Oh, I will. I will film that today. Okay. And also, what's the name of your part? The name of my part is is Stagehand Number One. This is really interesting. He's been talking to that guy for at least half an hour, and his colleagues are just standing there waiting. And now someone is getting out of the car. Are they talking to him? Hmm. So I'm wondering, because they don't seem to be, is he an informant? Or do they need a translator, translate, translator? I'm not sure. And this guy who got out of the car over there, who's he? He's someone with a dog. So, okay, so that's his car, I think. Now the dog is going to smell the car. I hope it's not a bomb dog. You think it is? Or is it... No. Narcotics. I'm like a journalist here. I'm a reporter. I'm roving here, people. Oh yes, he's smelling. Oh, and now he's marking something with a tire. And 
that guy being told to stand with, sort of with his back against this, probably so he won't recognize him if, he's, if there is a, a vendetta. Now they're going into the car. Okay, so the police is holding a passport inside. It looks Swedish though. Oh, maybe all passports look the same, maroon, right? Now, criminality doesn't amuse me at all. Maybe one last peek. And now, under the hood, is the god dog getting up there? Hmm. You must have thought these are mannequins. No, they're men standing in the window, looking, taking pictures, or maybe just posing. Not sure. Or maybe they are involved, pretending to be mannequins. He's pushing the dog in the car now. Well, his own car. And I guess the police are gonna sniff now. Hello, he said. Did you find anything? We couldn't find anything. Weapon or cocaine, nothing. And the police says, well, you know, we're not giving up. No one wins anything by giving up. Do you think a marathon runner wins anything by giving up after 10 meters? No. We are looking for weapons and guns, and drugs, and maybe prostitutes. We're not sure. And meanwhile, the mannequins standing really still, trying not to move, but looking cool. And now the man with the dog says, well, you know, the dog is really great, but he had COVID, so maybe he lost his sense of smell. I'm not sure. I had COVID and lost my sense of smell. Oh, now he's smelling it. Do you think this is something? Oh, this is the beginning of a porn movie, isn't it? Bend over, Mr. Policeman. Oh, he disappears into the car. What? 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 What's going on here? Oh, okay. I just thought a thought. Maybe they are mines. And they're just... No, they're not. Oh, they're kissing now, maybe. Maybe kissing behind that... Yes, maybe. You never know. I say they do. Oh, I can hear the sound almost. I can make the sound anyway. I love you, I love you, I love you. Oh, not in this, not in the shop window, please. Oh, no, there is someone in the shop. I can see someone in the background. And now they look like they're trying to sell the car. Like the man with the dog is saying, this is a great car. And the policeman said, well, it's been, you know, it's gone 80 miles. And I said, well, 80 miles is nothing for this car. It's white, it's pristine. And the police says, well, if you give me, you know, give me, if I, yeah, I, I, I pay 10,000 Swedish kroner for it. And the policeman says, no, the, the dog's owner says, you must be mad. And then they just look at the car. Is it worth? Yes, she says, it is worth more than that. I think, I think, she, she, oh, she's Irish. I think, this is my Irish, this is my, kind of Irish. Oh, I think, no. And then the dog says, dog owner says, close the door. And oh, he's Irish as well. Close the door. I'm not buying it. You're not, oh no, I'm not selling it. <laughs> I forgot to sell it when he's buying. And he says, I'm not, no, never. Oh, he's what he's not, now he's posh. I think the man with the dog is sort of, he has many dialects because he's a man of mystery. That dog wasn't really a dog. It was a friend of his, dressed as a dog, a plushie. If no one's going to shoot anyone, I'm going now. Soon. Waiting. No. It's an update. The man with the dog, no, the man with the plushie friend, gets in the car and goes away. He's going to get dressed as a plushie as well. As, as well. Is it called plushie? I think so. And suddenly, there were none left. All gone. Here with the makeup artist, David, and I want to ask him the question, what's the difference between plushies and furries? Plushies and flurries? Furries. furries. Plushies look like shit. <laughs> and furries look like animals. David, I need to have your reaction now when I tell you that which... Is it Starsky or Hutch who died today? What? Startsky or Hutch? I didn't know one of them died today. But one did. Who think? Who do you think that died? I think it was Hutch. 
What's his name? David So. Yes, you're right. Why did you think he died? Because he's had a tough life, alcoholic and so on. Okay. Yes. Oh. Sitting here with the actor Martin who's getting his hair cut. Yeah. And one of my followers asked, how, how long does it take to make a wig? How long do you think it takes to make Ooh. a wig? Pfft. Easy. I could do it in an hour. In an hour? Yep. Yep. David, are you better than that? To make a wig, it takes, I would say, closer to a week. <laughs> okay. <laughs> <laughs> well... So, I think you're better than Yes, so, so ask Martin to make your wigs from now on. Absolutely, <laughs> call me. Uh, hello and welcome to Swedish World of the Today. Swedish World of the Today is the month we live in. January, 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 January. I'm now going to use it in a sentence. Gud, vad du är tjock. Ja, men det är för det är precis efter jul. Jag kommer snart att vara smal igen. Varför då? Därför att i januari, då bantar alla. God, what, God, God, what you are fat. Yes, it's because it's us just a quick mix. But soon I will be not fat. Why? Because it's January and everyone is getting non, uh, non-fat then. Aha. Uh-huh. Uh, I hope this was helpful for you. If you're suddenly in Sweden and don't know uh, what uh, month it is, you can ask. And if they say uh, January, you know the month it is. Goodbye. Peter is here. He's been to, to London recently and he's got this new t shirt. Where did you buy it? Primark. Did you buy anything else there? Yes. You bought, you'd love Primark, don't you? Yes and no. Because I think Englishmen have a weird uh, size. Oh? I'm much taller than the regular man. Yeah, well, you're that in Sweden as well. Yes, but I think Scandinavians are taller. Yes, we are. Yeah. So all the all the t-shirts become square. Oh, because you have to have you you have to have the tallest, you have the biggest one, and it's just for fat people. Yeah. Yeah. And one one thing you're not is fat. It's tall. It's tall. <laughs> <laughs> Kiki is a spotlight operator, and she okay. says this is Thank really you. this is a really hard show to work on. Is there any any numbers you're not doing any? When do you have sort of breaks? Uh, at the sticka sticka. Okay. Yeah. That's it. Yeah. Oh well, something else too, but I don't remember. Englagård, yeah, the fika at Englagård. Okay. And uh, yeah, that's about it. Oh my god. Du Fanny. Ja. Ja, min mamma heter Hans. Vad vad säger du vem är det? Min mor far nej 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 jag har det. This is a day in a working actor's life. You do it, and you do it gladly. And I do it well. You do it well, <laughs> really well. So much weller. Than everyone else who so, thinks they're well. They're not well. No, they're bad. <laughs> mission and we are watching Julia Child on Johanna's uh, phone. You love her, don't you? I'm learning so much. So this we happened. Petra accidentally. <laughs> A little later on he's going to show his ass. So we had to we had to <laughs> So now we, David is going to put some makeup on it. <laughs> so, can you tell us a story about what you did? Uh, I fell into the backdrop. <laughs> Could happen to anyone. Could happen to anyone. Yes. Who did you 
Oh, you were naked as well? No, you weren't naked, but you had a strip. Yeah, yeah. You, yeah, you had nothing on. Yeah. Okay, good. Because I thought, wait, you must have broken something else. Is this the first time you sort of paint someone's bum, David? No, I've done it before. Oh. Yeah. I don't know what you did. I don't know what you did. It's just my girl. It's a little... Thank you. But God, but it does it hurt? Do you want to have some... No, no, no. I'm going to show you. So it's... Yeah, it's with you. Just it. Det gick vilt till igår. Liksom. Ja, men du säger till om du behöver något. Vad kul, kom sitt inte är istället. Yes. Precis vad jag bara bara tror. Folta, folta. David the Ass Master. Ja, ja, tack. Ja, det där kom inte så. It just disappeared. Kan det faktiskt passa? Men det där får man anstränga sig för att se. We paint we painting butts here. Painting butts. Yes. He hurt his butt. No. So what did you do with your butt? What did you do? With it? No one yeah, sees yeah, you. Yeah, yeah. 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 You almost did not. <laughs> and I, we have a quick change for Hannah. She gets lashes, a wig, and costumes. She goes from dowdy to sex toy. This is the scene where the other shows his bum. So we'll see if we can see it now, if David done a great job of it, or if it looks like scar bum. No, you can't see anything. Well done. It's time to say goodbye. I'll see you in 12 hours. Yeah. See you in 12 hours. In 12 hours. And you just sashay away. Sashay away. Yes. Yes. Like a little ho like a little pony. <laughs> <laughs> you won't believe this. I'm on my way home and look what happened again. Oh, don't know how. I how do I manage? How do I cope? I don't know. I'm brave. I'm just being brave. Brave. They do a lot of talking and hardly any shooting. Thank you for watching and for liking, commenting, subscribing and following. It really helps and uh, something to do with the internet and the algorithm, I think. So thank you so much.